Hi guys, Danielle back from when it was. I'm so glad you're back to see me again. I really appreciate you all and I am so happy that you're here. Now today I'm doing another Timu haul and they keep covering up my Timu, Timu logo. I want to have a bag that shows Timu on it. I've got it upside down. I've got part of the TE there, but they've covered it up again. Anyway, so I'm going to be showing now. I opened it up already so that it would make it easier to go through and show you everything. I wrote the prices on the bags. And y'all look, I'm wearing the shirt. Look, how cute is the shirt? Now I would have, um, I got a large thinking, you know, I can, I, I can go a little bit baggy on it and it is baggy. A large is a little too big, actually. I should have gotten a medium, but that's okay. I mean, I like it. Now, one thing I do know that when I wear it, I'm gonna actually have to wear the uh, crisscross strap bra instead of a regular bra because it kind of goes up right here. But it's it's in this um, waffle type of material. It's very soft, very comfortable, really, really cute. And I, when I saw it on the model, I thought there's no way this is gonna be as cute as it is on the model. And I actually kind of like it. And I can wear it out like this. I mean, it, honestly, it could actually be used as a maternity top. Or I can just tuck it in and wear a belt. You know, the style where everybody just, I don't know. I don't think that'll look good just because of the style of the bottom is so big. Um, maybe if I order another one, which I probably will in a cream color, I'll get the medium and see how that fits. So, but I did want to try out the, um, the clothing and see, I've seen a lot of Timu hauls on clothing and everybody seems to be pretty impressed with it. So for this shirt, I paid $7.98, I believe. Yeah, I paid $7.98 and it comes with a little zipper bag. Um, and then next I got, I wanted to get this because you know how the inside of your windshield always gets like just a little film on it. And so I, this is one of the things that I've been watching and I wanted to get this to clean the inside of my windshield of my car because I can't, you know, you know, you can't reach, especially over the steering wheel on the passenger side. It's, it's okay. You can pretty do, pretty much do that, but, and it, it's just a little wand that you pop in here. Let me see if I can do that. I paid for this. Uh, I paid two ninety. Uh, yeah, two ninety nine for it. And then you just, it's like a little, it's a yeah, microfiber. I, it's, I guess you can call it microfiber. It's not a good quality microfiber, but, uh, okay. So you put this on here and it doesn't seem to want to fit. Interesting. Okay. Well, it's supposed to fit on here and that came off while I was trying to fit it on there. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. There, there. It's barely on, but it's on and it, I can maneuver it some more and get it to slide over, but you can see here that, um, anyway, so that way you can just reach in. If you want to spray a cleaner on it, you can spray a cleaner on it. Uh, if you just want to do a dry wipe, you can do a dry wipe, especially if the inside of the windows are fogged up. So you just reach in. So that was, that was kind of fun. I'm glad I got that. This is, oh, I plan on going on more cruises soon. And one of the things they suggest on a cruise is that you get metal hooks because the walls of the cruise ships are metal. And you get metal hooks to hang, uh, you, to hang, whoops. Okay, they're not screwed together, so let me screw one of them together. All right, and they're all, they're, it's, they're little itty bitty ones. They're not big ones. Um, but if you wanna hang like your, your necklaces or a sun hat or something. So yeah, I paid uh, $3.98 for these and there's, I believe six of them in here. Yeah, it's a six pack. But uh, so yeah, so that's what I got. I got that. And they're like little ones. I'll get bigger ones too for like towels and whatever. But they, they're really, they seem to be really good magnets. They're not, you know, they're sticking together really well, but you do have to screw them all together. 
And then I got, I've got something big in here, but I want to wait. And then I got these for my grand darlings to put on their fingernails. And then I'll just paint a clear coat over them. They're just little fingernail decals. They're going to like those. Now this, let's see, how much did I pay for that? 80 cents. That was 80 cents. $1.48. Now what these are, um, I have so many things under my cabinet that have cords that when I try to put them away, I have to figure out how to wrap the cords and get the cords out of the way. So this is a cord wrapper. And then it comes with a sticker. I paid $1.48 for a five pack. I don't even think I'm gonna need all five of them. So you're gonna take the sticker and put one end on like that. And I brought my toaster over so I can show you. So you got one end on that. Peel the sticker off. And then you're gonna put the other end, I'm gonna put it on the back because it's got a wrap underneath my toaster, but that's a pain. So I'm literally just gonna stick this to the back of my toaster. And now when I put my toaster away, I can just wrap my cord around and then pop it in there and my co my toaster is put away. I'm so excited because it's such a pain. Like I would stick it down inside just to get it out of the way. And so, yeah, I'm really excited about that. That's a, There was a couple of things and you know, in a lot of Timu hauls you're seeing, well, especially the windshield cleaner, and the cord wrap. You'll see a lot of those in the team, team of hauls, but I am unsponsored. So what I'm doing is I'm buying things that I want to get that I feel will be useful to me. And so that I can test that out. And like Timu, when they sponsor people, they actually give them a list of items that they can buy off and talk about on YouTube. And I'm not doing that. I'm buying stuff I need, or not necessarily need, but um, <laughs> an unneeded need, I guess. So I'm buying stuff that I feel like I can use. So, and I've got a couple more things. I didn't, it's not a big haul this time, but uh, in the wintertime, the summertime, I switch my clothes out. So I have a bags of winter clothes and bags of summer clothes, depending on the season. And it's coming up time to put my winter clothes away, but I have a lot of sweaters. And when, when you're putting sweaters away, it's really not that easy to put sweaters away. So I bought some storage containers. This one is, um, it's a vertical one for 368. I don't remember how big they said it was, but so I'm like, okay, I wanna have something and to be able to put all my sweaters in and just put them away. Now, I'm folding this. I'm actually kind of surprised how big it's getting. I wasn't expecting it to get this big. Now, it does have the measurements, but honestly, I didn't. I, I, I just got the largest one because sweaters are big, and I knew I was going to need them. And this one stands up like this, so I can, and it's got a see-through, which I like that. It's got a see-through, so as I'm stacking them, I can actually see what's in them. And then I have a shelf under my clothing that I have them stacked on right now, but they just keep falling off, collecting dust. So this is good because now I can see what's in here. If I want to wear one of them, I can just pull it out and gently put the rest of them back in. And it's not going to be that, that hard to do. Uh, so yeah, so I'm really kind of excited about that. I was going to bring my sweaters out and, and show you packing them up so I could show you how much I'm actually getting in here. And honestly, it's not going to surprise me if this doesn't hold all of my sweaters. But I do like the sweaters that go down like past your knees and um, so like that look like little sweater jackets. Now I also got a, I got a set of three on this one was 928 because I didn't know if it would hold it all. And also, on the roller coaster of life is also a roller coaster of weight gain and weight loss. So now I have a whole bunch of clothes that are too small for me, which I plan on getting back into. So I am going to store those away. And they're not clothes that, I mean, right now, like not a lot goes out of style. So, um, 
you can pretty much keep almost everything. There are some like the the jeans and stuff. Now this one is the biggest one I believe, and it's it's pretty similar to the one I just showed you. It's got it's got windows so you can actually see what's in it. It zips up, but this one these zip up like this instead of vertical. Oh, like this one is vertical where this one is horizontal so I can lay stuff in here that one's pretty big and I think the three that I got are all three different sizes so I'm, I'm I, I could be wrong I don't remember how I how I ordered it and this one didn't take as long to get to me as my first order did so um, no it looks like yeah this one's the medium one so this one's a little bit smaller. Let me see. Is it? Oh, let me see. Okay, yeah. Um, no, they're all. The, it looks like they're all the same size. So I am definitely going to be able to put all my sweaters away and um, all of my clothes that don't fit me right now. Get those put away. Bring out my summer clothes, put my winter clothes away. Now, it's funny because last week we were in the 80s and now we're, got, we're snowing again. <laughs> so it's like, it's that time of year where you just don't know what to expect. So yeah, so I've got three of them, uh, the horizontal ones and one of the vertical ones. So I'm really excited about that. Now, one other thing I got, and I honestly, I haven't even really, looked much at this because I saw a te techno or a technology Timu haul and I wanted to buy this my nine-year-old granddaughter like, is going to be 10 in May and I wanted to get her the six-year-old and the nine-year-old are both into cell phones right now and the six-year-old actually earned like they earn money by doing chores and she earned enough money to um, buy a, a play phone. Well, she's six, so for her birthday, I might, for her seventh birthday, I might get her one of these also. But y'all, this is an iPhone. This is an iPhone. Look at, look how, look how tiny this is. Now, this is an aqua blue, really, really cute. Now, when I was watching the tech haul on this, it actually works and you can hook it up to uh, a phone line like it actually works now I don't know if it's charged because you just let me pull it out of the box so let me power it on let me see what happens here um, no it's not charged okay that's okay I will get it charged and from what I understand, look, it's got three cameras on the back. Of course, it's it's a, a Soyuz D18, which is an iPhone. I mean, it's it's not iPhone, iPhone, but it's a version of the iPhone. And so I don't know if that's got... Anyway, there's no place to put a SIM card in it from what I can tell. So I don't know how you would be able... Oh, wait, yeah, 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 right there. You can actually put a SIM card in it. I don't know if you can see that, the light shining up. There we go. So right there, you can put a SIM card in it, power button, volume button. You can download apps on it. But what I have a feeling is mom and dad will hook it up to the internet. So the only time she'll ever be able to use it is at home on the internet. Um, but I mean, can you imagine like <laughs> talking? Like I'm using my phone to record, so I can't really give you a... An, an idea of how tiny this is, but even like on my last haul, I showed you this video game that I got. Like there, there's a comparison of how tiny this thing. It's like three inches by one and a half inch. It's tiny, tiny. But I honestly think she's gonna love having this little phone. And then later on, and it comes with a little clear case. So, and later on, um, I've seen a lot of fingerprints already on that clear case, so interesting. Okay, I don't know why there's so many fingerprints on it. Comes with a charging cord, and then it, it comes with the little pin so you can put your SIM card in it. 
It's got, it comes with, oh, it comes with more than I expected it to come with. It comes with, check this out, a screen protector. Wow, look at that. It comes with a screen protector. That's interesting. And of course, it also comes with, if <laughs> I can get it out of there, the instructions. It's got an instruction manual in uh, Chinese and I'm assuming English. They both look Chinese. So they'll probably have English on one side and Chinese on the other, which is which is not uncommon for um, things bought from China. Uh, let me see. Yeah, yeah. So that's English on one side and Chinese on the other. So that's good. Uh, that's going to be fun. I'm going to show this to my son who is, he uh, creates, um, he's in IT. Uh, just easy way of putting it, he's in IT. So I'm going to show this to him. So you guys, that's it for my Timu haul. And thank you very much for watching this part of it. If you want, if you want to stick around, I'm going to show you a few more things that I thrifted because um, that's what I really do. But um, I wanted to try out Timo. So, um, but I thrifted from a thrift store and uh, I'm going to show you what I, what I came home with and how much I paid for it. And so I've got some really cute things here. And so, and I, as a lot of my followers know, I like wall pockets. I'm a big wall pockets fan. And so I actually got two of them. This one was $1.99. And it is a, uh, let's see, it's, it's made in Japan. Now they put this Goodwill sticker right over the thing, so I have to look, uh, by Lego. The, okay, L-E-G-O, Lego, but it's made in Japan. And um, anyway, so that's one of the wall pockets that I got. Now you guys check this one out. I'm so excited about this one. This is a handmade wall pocket. Look at this thing. It I paid $15 for this. And it, I mean, look at the applied flowers, the duck. I fell in love with this. Now I saw several wall pockets. Um, it's obviously in the water and it's got a whole bunch of stuff like I just fell in love with this. This is probably like every time I get a new wall pocket, I'm like, oh, this is probably my favorite one now. Um, I can't wait. Oh, I noticed that he's got a little chippy on the on the flower leaf here, but that's okay. Honestly, you, I didn't even notice it till just now. That's how unnoticeable it is. Y'all don't forget to like and subscribe. And drop a comment in the bottom. Tell me what your favorite things are. I've got a few more things to show you and then we'll be all done. Now I'm gonna be doing a whatnot sale um, probably this week and I'm gonna just do all salt and pepper shakers because I've got two tubs down here full of salt and pepper shakers. But this is gonna be added to the pile. Look how cute these guys are. And they are Japan. Now this one, it looks like, I'm, I'm not sure, I haven't I haven't taken the Goodwill. They were 99 cents each. Um, this one looks like it's got the cork on the inside. And how you do that, because these older corks dry out really easily. And so how you, you just stick something in there and break it up. And um, look how cute these are. I just love these. Uh, and I have not bought as many salt and pepper shakers recently as be just because I'm not really selling them that much. But I couldn't pass these guys up for 99 cents each. And I just think they are the cutest little uh, bears. I don't know if I want to call them bears or whatever. You some you somebody tell me what you think these are. Next, I got and I just think they're so cute. I love them. I got this, and I honestly don't know what it is. So hopefully, you guys can help me figure it out. But I liked it, so I bought it. Um, Two ninety nine, I paid for it, and it looked like it's glass. Um, Pottery, I'm, I'm not sure, but on the inside, and then it's this, and I don't know if it's like a double boiler, like a, to melt chocolate in. I honestly can't tell you what it is, but I absolutely love it. I absolutely thought it was so pretty, and the blue, and it, it just, isn't it so pretty? Um, but if you guys know what this is, please drop a, a note in the bottom and tell me what it is, if you've seen it before. <laughs> Because I, I just don't know. I just liked it, and so I had to have it. 
And then I got, um, now Crazy Lamp Lady found a bunch of these and she picked them up and then lo and behold, here I go shopping and I find a bunch of them. So I got for $1.99 a piece, there are two, four, six, seven starfish all in different colors. And they're all on my table. There's the orange and the aqua. Let me see. Well, I, I, I want to say orange. This one looks more reddish orange to me. So I guess this one's more of a peachy orange, but on the back it's red and orange. So, uh, and they're glittery. And the glitter, yes, does come off. I'm going to move the basket over here so I can show you. So there's a blue one. Now somebody had them glued to the wall. So I've got to work to get that glue off the back of them. And I honestly, I've been looking them up and I can't find comps anywhere. There's no marking on the back who made them. They are chalkware. And there's the purple one. And then here is the pink one. They are dirty. I do have to wash them. Um, I did wash one that was really, really bad because I wanted to make sure I could wash it and not wash all the sparkly off. And then it also had, for $2.99, the seahorse. And this one's an aqua, and it was the only seahorse they had. I would have gotten more. Uh, and then this really pretty shell was 99 cents, so I picked that one up too. So, and then the basket I got, because I've been collecting baskets, because along with wall pocket wall, I want to do a basket wall. So I picked up interesting baskets that I think are really pretty, and this basket was $4.99, and it's big. You can see how big it is. So, and then, um, yeah, that's it. That's, like I said, it was gonna be a short one. It wasn't gonna be a really long one this time. And I got my new shirt on, and I just think it's cute with the little peekaboo shoulders. And uh, anyway, so you guys, thanks for joining me today. Don't forget to hit, oops, drop my, sorry, my remote control. Um, don't forget to hit like and subscribe. And drop me a message on the bottom, share. Uh, subscribing is free, it doesn't cost you any money to subscribe. And I would really like to see you guys all coming in and sharing the love. And I really appreciate each and every one of you for coming in and watching. And you guys take care, have a wonderful week. And the next time I do a Timu shopping spree, <laughs> Go ahead and uh, our, I'm going to do another haul video for you. And when I go thrift hauling again, I will show you another haul video on that. So don't, don't think I'm forgetting about y'all. Don't forget my haulers. I'm not, I'm not forgetting about you guys, but you know, Timu's a big thing right now. And I'm actually having fun going through. I honestly, you could spend hours going through that website. And it is like Wish. I mean, I, don't get me wrong. It is kind of like Wish. Um, it's just Wish just takes so long. And I have gotten some really duds from Wish um, thinking, especially clothes. Like I, I see something that's really cute in clothes and I think, oh, I really like that. And then I get it and it's just, it's not what it was on, on, the, <clears throat> on the website. So, but so far, this one, this one I've liked. Um, I am going to order more. I've got a t-shirt, another t-shirt, tank top, two tank tops in my shopping cart. Now the thing about Timu though is it sells out really quick. So that's why I got the foam now, even though I don't need it until the end of next month. Um, because they sell out really quick and they may or may not get it back. So the t-shirts I want to get ordered because I want to make sure I get them. And now I'm seeing, I don't know if I need to get a large or if I need to get a medium. So in the, t in the tank tops, um, there's, I have a large and a medium in two different colors in my cart. This one I'll probably order in a medium in a cream color because I really liked it too. So anyway, you guys, thanks for watching me. Come back and see me again next time. And y'all have a wonderful week. Bye.